How you doing all you fine guys and gals out there in YouTube land? RG here, Ryan's Beer Reviews and Tools. Welcome to my channel. Um, I think we have a good one today, as you saw earlier. From you, from Treehouse, <laughs> Treehouse Brewing, called Juice Machine. I got some information on it here. Uh, let me just say about the founder. The brewery was founded in 2011 by three gentlemen, Mr. Damien Goudreau, Mr. Dean Rohan, and Mr. Nate Lanier. They started the brewery and it took off and it's a big success, the brewery. Um, this is a double IPA. On the can it says American double IPA. 8.2% alcohol by volume. Keep cold. Juice machine is essentially a marriage of the King Julius malt with a hopping schedule more intense than of that of very green. The use, now listen to this, these are the hops. Magnum, Columbus, Amarillo, Citra, and Galaxy hops create perhaps our most complex beer with unapologetic flavors of mango and so forth. All right, so let's uh, make, oh, I like that. So let's uh, get a glass, we do have one here. Uh, it's from my number one son, uh, him and his, my daughter-in-law, lovely wife. Uh, it was my birthday, they gave me a, a basket with all kinds of beer in it from this package store, Lazy Dog. And uh, I call it Lazy Dog Beer Shop. Uh, around here we call, where well, they sell liquor and beer package stores, but other parts of the country it's a uh, liquor store or beer shop. It's in New Hampshire. It's in New Hampshire. All right, let's get to it. I do have, I'm here a little while after the beer review, and I got some nice pumpkin seeds from Bob's Red Mill. My wife buys all the flour and oats and so forth from them. All right, excuse me. Uh, so it's a little dry. It's cold here today, nice and sunny. Really like a beautiful looking day, but it's probably about 33, 32 degrees, bordering off freezing. Mm. That's why you see me with the attire I have on. <laughs> okay, enough talk. Let's crack this open. My tonic's up there. What's it doing up there? Ah, uh, okay. Ah, uh, just seeing uh, what the angle looked like. We lost our camera lady. All right, here we go. Oh, that's nice looking. Ooh, that is nice. That is very nice looking. There is a little bit more in there. All right. So what else we have on this here? It's a double IPA. Uh, took my ears a little bit here. Sorry for the noise, we're pretty close to a street. I haven't done a beer review in a while. I've been doing all my tool reviews and backlogging on that to post them. And, uh, all right. Uh, I mentioned the hops. It's going to be uh, this juice machine is going to be a New England IPA double IPA, 8.2 percent alcohol by volume. All right, no further ado. Oh yeah, tropical fruits come right out. Oh, you can tell by the look at that how hazy that is. The color of it. Now this is a beer. Far from what a lager beer looks like, and not that lager beer is a bad looking beer. Cause I like lager with them, and number one beer is lager beers. And uh, place down in Framingham, Jack's Abbey's do some fantastic lager beers. And uh, I do, but look at the color of this, I mean, you can see it. I don't know if it's too dark under here, but uh, it's really an orange, hazy or orange, half orange. Oh. Oh. That really, the aroma. Tropical fruit. I'm picking up on mango, the number one, uh, and I do enjoy mango. It's 
excuse me. I do enjoy mangoes. I do have a couple of videos where I dissect a mango. Uh, I have another video where I cut up a, a mango and I infuse it in a beer and drink that beer with a lager beer. And, uh, this is going to be good, I can tell. That is quite the juice bomb. Love the juice machine. All right, cheers. Mm. Oh, that has some good flavors. Picking up on some of the hops. They do have a lot of hops in this here. There's a little bit of a aftertaste, a wee bit of bitterness. Nice white head on it. 8.2% alcohol by volume. Cheers. A very, very mild astringency to it. It's not a juice bomb. It, go, it is a New England IPA. It's not down the road of a juice bomb. It could be if it didn't have that much, a little bit of astringency. And it's surprising because all the hops that they have in this, uh, it is a bit surprising. Uh, let me go through the hops again with, on the cans that we have written here. Excuse me. Magnum, Columbus, Amarillo, Citra, and Galaxy. Now, I'm not that familiar with the Amarillo and the Columbus or the Magnum. The Magnum and the Columbus, uh, or I should say the Magnum and the Amarillo, uh, their acids on it, the beta acids or the alpha acids, may be given the astringency in this here. I don't think it's the center of the galaxy, which is very, very, very common in your New England juice bombs. It's had a nice flavor. Very drinkable. Leaves a wee bit of bitterness. And there is, like I said, a stringency when you, not a lot, but it, it, it's less than you know it's there. Mm. I'm not going to run this long. This is one of the hottest days we don't want to be here with you. And you can tell my attire. My attire. And uh, I haven't done a beer review in a long time, so it was nice uh, having this one here. Uh, Treehouse Brewing out of Charlton and Tewksbury, Massachusetts. I know uh, Charlton has been the place to go uh, because it was the only brewery that they had. But Tewksbury, uh, Mass, is right on uh, right on Route 38, near towns of uh, Wilmington and. Uh, I don't know if the next town is Ch uh, Lowell, after Tewksbury, it might be Lowell. Uh, so it's a little north on, on Route 38. Uh, a bit of a ride for us to get there. Uh, I've been there in, I haven't been there in a long time, but uh, I've been there a couple of times to Treehouse. I may see some photos uh, as I say this. All right, so I'm not gonna run this long. Good combination, to be saying. Mouthfeel is is full, nice full mouthfeel. And that tropical fruit is the backbone of this uh, brew. Would I get this again? Yes, I would. I would get this again. It wouldn't be on the top of the list because it had a little bit of astringency, but uh, I would get this again. Pretty sure I would. All right, I will end it here. Good combination for sure. From uh, Eastern Massachusetts, um, RG here. I'm gonna sign off to all you folks until next time. 
Uh, have a good day. If you're going to drink alcohol, don't run heavy equipment or drive vehicles. Enjoy the day. It's a beautiful day here today. Uh, so, uh, all right. That said, cheers. So, with that said, ciao. I will sit here going. I will sit here and start eating these here. Ciao. <laughs> Eh, Son of a bitch. <sighs> that would be...